guys, welcome back to today's video. If you're new here, my name is Allison. This is Otto. I'm so, so excited to be giving you guys another fashion haul. These are my favorite videos to make and I love sharing my personal style with you guys. Thank you to Princess Polly for sponsoring today's video. I'm freaking out because Princess Polly is one of my absolute favorite stores. I've done hauls with them before on my channel and this time I have a discount code for you guys. I'll leave my discount code up here and in the description box as well so you can shop all of these new spring pieces. My code is AllisonXO. They have so many good trends on there, affordable clothing items. They're all high quality and I'm so excited to show you guys what I got for spring. So this is gonna be a spring try on haul which is so refreshing. I live in Miami so I feel like I've been dressing like this for the entirety of winter, but I know some people are so excited to start hopping right into spring style. Make sure you follow my Instagram, AROLI. I always have it linked down below because I'm gonna be styling all of these pieces on there. Shipping is always so fast. It ships within three to six days on orders over $50 to the US. Princess Polly also offers shop pay and after pay to US customers. I'm always browsing on their site for what's new and what's in style and best selling. Without further ado, let's just get into the video. So I'm actually wearing the first piece. I couldn't wait. It's so cute. I like match my bed right now. I immediately knew I needed a white little romper dress like this. I've been on the hunt for a really good white one that's really girly, has the puffy sleeves for spring. I just think it's so fun. I've been really into girly styles lately. Normally I'm very more tomboy street style, but for some reason, I think because I have like shorter hair now, I'm just into like a really girly look. I'll show you guys more when I do the try on part in the mirror, but it's just a cute little romper. It's so short. It like looks like a really cute little girly short dress, but really it's a romper so you're not going to like show anything, which is really nice. It's a cotton material and I love how textured it is. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but it has this textured pattern to it almost. A square neck, I love because you can accessorize and wear really cute necklaces with it. It's called the Lorna Romper in white. I got it in a size US 4 and I feel like a US 4 and a US 6 is very true to my size on their site. I'm always in between. So if I think something looks like it's gonna run small, I'll get it a little bigger in a US 6. But for the US 4, I think this fits me perfectly. I am 5'2", five, 5'3", five, so I'm a little on the shorter side and I feel like it's a really good length for me. If you're a little taller, you might wanna size up. Next dress I got is this stunning nylon material, I think it is. Absolutely obsessed with the material, which is the main reason I got it. And I'm really into little tube top dresses. I think they are the most flattering on me. Again, I think because it has that straight across neckline, which just really works with a fuller chest. Best part of the dress is the side detail. It's completely ruched all the way down and then it has a big slit and then it just ties which I think is so flattering and so cute and different. I can't get over how comfortable the material is. It feels like a little workout dress. Like I feel like you could wear this for a workout dress if you wanted to. I mean I wouldn't really want to sweat in it but I just think it's adorable. I can picture it with platform heels for a night out or like a daytime little look by the beach. I think it's very Miami too and it's also kind of neutral because it's just that charcoal gray color. I've been obsessed with this color recently. It's called the Caprani mini dress in gray. Again, I got it in a US 4 and I think it fits really true to size. It's all about comfortable fashion and I think this definitely fits into that category because it's super, super cute, but also just comfort is key and it's something that I would love to grab for and throw on in my closet. Let's move on into tops. So this next set I got is a two piece set. It is a little mini nylon bolero, long sleeve, and then it comes with the matching tube top. I like this tube top because it's a little different because it's like a bandana almost. It points down at an angle, which I really like. I think it's different. I think it's unique and flattering. The matching bolero. Boleros are huge this year and I don't have many. I feel like you always see the boleros that have the knit look that are a sweater material and this is different because it's nylon. Sticking with the comfortable theme, I would want to grab for this in my closet and wear it all the time just because it feels so smooth and cooling. It's called the Coslo Bolero Top. I got it in a US 4, true to size, fits me really well. I'm glad I got the 4. I wouldn't want to size up. I feel like it's a perfect size because I feel like the times I have sized up with boleros, they'll fall off my shoulder. So this one fits pretty snug, which I like. I think it would be paired so cute with anything, even sweatpants, a little mini skirt, 
jeans, pants, you could wear it with whatever you want and really fit it to your true style. So that's what I love about these types of tops. They have other colors, but I got it in sage too because I wore sage tops the other day and I got so, I've been getting so many comments recently about how green is my color. Moving on to another top. I feel like I cannot have enough little mini crop tops like this because I always am going out to dinner and doing things at night in Miami. And since the weather is so nice, I always want to wear little tops like this. Some tops and halter tops. I feel like I have so many of but I can't get enough. This one's nice because it's just one thick strap at the neck. It actually ties in the back and it has really long thick straps in the back which are really cool. I don't know if you can tie it different ways. You might be able to kind of like maneuver it in different ways but I really like the ties on it. They're so thick. It comes in different colors. I think it also came in white but I have a lot of white things so I wanted to get the blue. I feel like this baby blue is really pretty for spring. It reminds me of Cinderella. So I feel like I might pair it with something white on the bottom and give a little like Cinderella look. I did size up and get this in a US 6 just because I figured it would be kind of like a little tiny crop top and I am so happy that I sized up. I even would size up the next size and I think it would still fit. So definitely size up. I feel like it's hard to find little mini tops like this that fit my bust. So I was very satisfied with the fit of this. Next top, I'm screaming at this one. I unfortunately am gonna be returning it because it doesn't fit me right. I feel like it's not a good top if you have a bigger chest, but look how stunning it is. So attracted to ballet core lately, which is so not true to my own style, but I've been seeing it so much everywhere and I feel like for spring and like Valentine's Day and when we're getting into these warmer months, I'm just attracted to more girlier fits. So I think this is so cute. I've never seen anything like it really. It's called the Godet Top in pink. I did get it in a US 4, but I still felt like if I sized up, it just, the fit of it, just something about it wasn't right for my body shape, but I still wanted to share on here because I it's one of my favorite tops on their site right now and I wish it fit me so go get it love tops that tie in the middle of the chest like this so it has the strings and then the opening in the stomach which I think is really flattering it's very silky and lightweight a little bit see-through so keep that in mind and then the sleeves are not bell bottomy but they do billow out they're not just completely straight it also has a matching skirt set on the site and I think that combination is to die for. I would definitely buy both of them if you are into this style, but definitely fits the ballet core trend that we have been seeing. Let's transition into bottoms. I had to get a cute little cargo skirt. So I have a couple cargo skirts, but none that look like this. It's definitely very mini and it has pockets on either side, which I think is such a cool street style, cool girl vibe. We have been seeing belts coming back into style. I'm not a belt girl. I have no idea how to style belts. So I love that this skirt already came with a belt because it's a way for me to incorporate that style without having to like think too much about it. I love how thick it is. It's so edgy. It reminds me of like middle school when everyone would wear thick studded belts and it has a square buckle, everything about it, I love it. It's so thick and high quality. It's called the Iconic Cargo Mini Skirt, obviously in white, another white piece. I even see this paired with that blue Cinderella top I was showing you guys. I think it'd be a cute little outfit. Perfect for spring. I love wearing white in spring. See it paired with all of these tops that I just showed you. Got it in a US 4 and I'm really glad I did. It is a little short, but again, it's advertised as a mini skirt, so they are gonna be short and it fits me in the waist. I didn't want it to be too big in the waist, even though there is a belt. The belt is functional. I forgot I got this. So this is another skirt that I got, but this time, very different vibe. Hopping on the long denim skirt trend. So this has been around for a while. I think last year too, more in the fall and winter. I always love the trend, but I was just kind of like waiting to hop on to it. It takes me a long time to like really figure out if I want a trend, if it's sticking around long enough, if I'm wasting my time, if I'm wasting my money. This is a trend that I've seen sticking around for a long time. I still see people styling them and I love it. And I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna regret if I don't hop on this and style it. I think it's so cute. When I saw this one on Princess Polly, I was like, I need to get it because it's the perfect wash. This is the exact, it's like a medium wash, not too light, not too dark. And then it has a really, really long slit that goes all the way up, which I love. And then I love the distressed hem at the end. I don't see a lot with this distressed hem and I really liked that. It has the pockets in the butt and it's kind of like an asymmetrical waist, very subtly, which I like. It's called the Benetti Midi Denim Skirt. So it is a midi skirt, but because I'm short, it goes all the way down on me, but I feel like I'm gonna wear it with heeled 
booties or heels or something with a platform so it doesn't bother me that it shows that long on me. I'm gonna get it in a US 4, true to size size, and they didn't have it in a US 4, so I got a US 6. And it is a little big. I would definitely stick to your true to size size. Can't wait to style this on my Instagram. The pair of pants I got are, dun dun dun, a cargo pant. Could not do this haul without getting a pair of cargo pants. They're always in style. Any season, you can make them work. The reviews online said these are so, so flattering and they definitely live up to the hype. And then they have a million different colors of these to choose from. Not a million, but like so, so many. So it was really hard for me to choose, but I got them in the color khaki. And they are a little more green than I expected. I feel like they're really picking up green, but they're supposed to be more of a khaki color, which I really like, because I have a bunch of dark green cargo pants, but I like that these are a little different. Technically, the color is light khaki, and they're called the Miami Vice cargo pants. They are a little long on me, so I feel like if you are taller, these will definitely work for you. I kind of have to roll them up, which I don't mind because I have to do that with a lot of my pants. I got them in a US 4. I feel like they're very true to size, and I just feel like they're very flattering on. They accentuate your figure, make your butt look good. I love all of the different pockets and loops that the pants have. And I just think they're such a staple. I'm gonna wear these all the time, style them many different ways. Last item that I got is a pair of shoes. I actually get shoes all the time on Princess Polly. I have so many little like mule heels from them. So here they are. I'm obsessed. Look at this heel. It's so thick and chunky. I love chunky heels like this because they make the shoes so much more easier to walk in. I'm always looking for like actual comfortable heels. And these are very strappy, which I like. I really like the square toe. They wrap around the ankle and strap and the, they have these cute little like keychains all over them. I think it's a, a bull. And you have the bull right here. It makes it a little more edgy but they're very high quality. You can tell how high quality these heels are. They're definitely worth the price. I think these were a little more pricier on Princess Polly. They were like 150. I originally got these in a size seven, which is my true to size size. I feel like Princess Polly shoes run a lot smaller. So I got a size eight and the eight fits me way better. I have a wider foot. I would size up. I would rather have my heels a little bit bigger so they're a little roomier because I feel like your feet swell up when you wear heels. So cute and I'm gonna pair them with all of these clothing pieces that I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this Princess Polly haul. Thank you so much to Princess Polly for sponsoring today's video. Like always, I will have my discount code AllisonXO linked down in the description as well as all of the links to the pieces so you can shop them. Lots more spring outfits to come. I will be styling all these pieces on my Instagram so go follow me on my socials and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!